Rentaverse or a Pokeball to open up, which is actually a Pokemon collection tin. So inside of this, there are three booster packs and a coin that um, isn't basically it's the content inside of the ball. So we have three chances to pull something decent. Hopefully, we can get something decent out of this uh, collection, and uh, yeah, we can have something else to add in. So our pulls from our last booster pack was a Cherum and a Blipbug, not the best but not the worst but as I say you have to be in it to win it ended up with a green and white code card so you know, not too bad, not too shabby so yeah, I guess we better open this bad boy up today there is a whole set of these that you can collect you can get the great ball, you can get the master ball the normal poker ball um, the only thing I'll say is they, de they dent very easily so this one says made in China D20 Okay, so you want to just pop this off. When it comes out, we have three booster packs. Sun and Moon Base. Ooh, we got a Breakpoint from XY Breakpoint. Nice. And Burning Shadows. And inside of here, we have a Volcanion coin as well. So not too bad. This is useful. I like collecting these Pokeballs. I think they're pretty cool just to keep things in. So... Another one to add into my collection. Three booster packs to open up today. Obviously, the oldest being uh, Breakpoint. Then it would be Sun and Moon. And then it would be Burning Shadows. I don't like how these just feel like they're going to damage the cards, how these are put in there. Um, without further ado, we'll open this one up first. If you like Pokemon, you want to go to www.pokemon.com to check out all the latest and greatest products. So, Fiery Battles and Deep Shadows. What stage, what strange fire lurks in the shadows Minions of Team Skull and a cavalcade of new Pokemon stand ready to battle in the dark of night and in the blazing sun. Slug into with new titans like Necrozma GX, Marshmallow GX, Tapu Fini GX or battle with trusty allies from Machamp GX and Charizard GX to Dark Red GX and Ho Ho GX. Fight for what is right with the Pokemon TCG Sun and Moon Burning Shadows expansion. 140 cards uh, in this expansion. So yeah, let's <clears throat> let's go. Okay, green code card first of all. Put that by there. Porygon, 130 health points, which is a I'm joking. 130 is its number. It only has 60 health points. I just wanted to see if anyone was actually paying any attention. Um, virtual Pokemon from Generation One. Code check and beam are its moves and abilities. Panport up next. 70 health points, water type Pokemon. Of course, having a move for water gun. Being a spray Pokemon with a dex entry of 515. Pansage, 70 health points, grass, monkey Pokemon, dex entry of 4 and 511. Vine Whip is its move. Esper up next, 60 health points, psychic type Pokemon, restraint Pokemon with a dex entry of 677. It has a move of perplexing eyes. Sorks up next with 90 health points, being a fighting type Pokemon, being a karate Pokemon with a dex entry of 539, having two moves, one of Brick Break and the other of Quick Guard. Noibat is the pull from this pack today, 50 health points, being a normal type Pokemon, being a sound wave Pokemon, having a dex entry of 714 and a move of agility. Electros, 140 health points, electric type Pokemon, Elephish Pokemon. Dex entry of 604, two moves, one of Vacuum Bolt and the other of Dark Clamp. Psychic type energy, Metapod, 80 health points, Generation 1 Pokemon, Cocoon Pokemon. Dex entry of 11, two moves, one of Shed Skin and the other of Ram. Bodybuilding Dumbbells, uh, Pokemon tool, attach a Pokemon tool to one of your Pokemon that doesn't already have a Pokemon tool attached to it. The Stage 1 Pokemon this card is attached to gets 40 plus health points. 113 out of 147. And we have a ride on up for our very last card from this pack. 110 health points, of course, being a fighting type Pokemon with a dex entry of 112. Being a Generation 1 Pokemon, being an OG, is a Drill Pokemon. Two moves, one of Mega Horn and the other of Rock Tumble. Okay, so not the best, but not the worst. Alright, 
two booster packs left. We'll go for the base Sun and Moon next. And as it says here, welcome to the tropical Alola region. Start your journey with Rowlet, Litten, and Poplio. Then seek the legendary Pokemon Solgaleo GX and Lunala GX to witness the awesome power of the new kind of Pokemon. Each Pokemon GX brings a attack so devastating that you can use only one of them per game. Discovering dozens of never before seen Pokemon, Alola forms of some familiar favorites and new ways to battle in the Pokemon TCG Sun and Moon expansion. 140 cards are in this set. Okay. Green code card for today. All right, without further ado, let's do this. First of all, we have Maku Hitter, two moves, one of strength, the other a surprising attack. It's a Guts Pokemon, dex entry of 296, and has 80 health points, being a fighting type. <clears throat> Chin Chow up next, 70 health points, electric type Pokemon, angler Pokemon with a dex entry of 170, two moves, one of Electro Ball, the other of Searching Light. Toga Zamaru, 70 health points, electric type Pokemon, Roly Poly Pokemon, dex entry of 777, so it should be very lucky. Uh, defense Kill is its ability, and its move is Discharge. Then we have Kavana up next. 60 health points being a darkness type Pokemon with a dex entry of 318. It's a savage Pokemon, two moves, one of North Rue and the other of Bite. Then we have Picky Peck, 50 health points, which is a normal type Pokemon with a dex entry of 731. It's a Woodpecker Pokemon and it has a move of Rock Smash. Now we have Beware with 130 health points, which is a normal type Pokemon, dex entry of 760, strong arm Pokemon, two moves, one of Superpower and the other of Bear Hug. <laughs> And we have Butterfree, Generation 1 Pokemon with 130 health points, being a grass type, of course, being a butterfly Pokemon. Two moves, one of Whirlwind, and the other is Cybolt. Then we got ourselves a Steel type energy for today, followed up by Nest Ball, which is the Pokeball that you see in front of us just here. Um, search your deck for a basic Pokemon and put it onto your bench, then shuffle your deck. 123 out of 149, and it is a Trainum Item Nest Ball. Poliwhirl up next, 90 health points, water type Pokemon, dex entry of 61, Tadpole Pokemon, of course being a water type with two moves, one of Waste Splash and the other of Devil Slap. And the last card from this pack for today was a Steeny with 90 health points, being a grass type Pokemon, dex entry of 762, being a fruit Pokemon, having two moves, one of Stomp and the other of Sweet Scent. So, not too bad, not too bad. sort these cards out for a second so in total now I've opened up three booster packs Okay, last one. We have an XY Breakpoint booster pack to open up for today, and hopefully we can get something decent out of this one. So, the hour grows desperate, and two worlds stand at the brink. The Pokemon TCG XY Breakpoint expansion reveals the growing rift between the twin worlds, first discovered by shiny Mega Gyarados EX, and the rift tears through the skies. More Pokemon are drawn into the struggle, including Greninja GX, uh, uh, Greninja Break, Luxray Break, Mega Sizzle EX, can they mend the rift and save both worlds from collision chaos? The Pokemon TCG XY expansion for Breakpoint contains 120 cards. And as I've said throughout this video, you want to find more about Pokemon, you want to know what's going on with the latest and greatest things that are coming out of the Pokemon factory, then you want to head over to www.pokemon.com to check out all the latest and greatest products. Okay, let's uh, clear some space and do this final pack. I'm hoping we get something decent out of this one, I'm not gonna lie, guys. I um, ain't really had the best pulls with these two greens, but we move, we move. But the first booster pack we opened up was a green and white code card, so, you know, I guess it was pretty decent. And uh, yes, yeah, so we will do a recap at the end of everything that we've got. So, let's go.
Okay, green code card. Nothing good in this one. Oh well. Okay, and let's go. So, C dot, 50 health points, deck century 273, grass type, acorn Pokemon, and has one move of ramp. Chikorita, deck century of 152, leaf Pokemon being a grass Pokemon, 60 health points, two moves, one a tackle, the other a blot. Corsula, 80 health points, water type Pokemon. Dex entry of 222 being a coral Pokemon. Mm. Are its moves. Fair throw. 80 health points. Poodle Pokemon. Dex entry of 676. Has a move of tight jaw and another move of collect. Pharaseed. 60 health points. Steel type. Thorn Seed Pokemon. Dex entry of 597. And has a move of harden. Fair throw. 80 health points. Normal type, Poodle Pokemon, 676 is its dex entry, two moves, one of collect, the other of tight jaw. Pangoro, darkness type, two moves, one of bluster swing, the other a parting shot. It is a daunting Pokemon, 675 is its dex entry, being a darkness type. Delinquent, trainer supporter. Discard any stadium card in play if you do your opponents discard three cards from his or her hand. Gabite, 80 health points, fighting type, Sand Tomb Pokemon is its sorry, Sand Tomb is its move. Cave Pokemon is its type. Dex entry is 444. And the last card for today is Reverse Valley Trainer Stadium. So choose which way this card faces before you play it. The attack this Players, Darkness Pokemon, do 10 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon before applying weaknesses and resistance. And if you play it this way, choose which way this card faces before you play it. Any damage done to this Pokemon player's steel Pokemon by an opponent's attack is reduced by 10. Not too bad. Right, we're going to have a big recap of everything that we've got for today. Let me just sort everything out. Yeah. Right, so our trainer supporters for today, Delinquent and Rapid Strike Style Mustard. Our stadium was Reverse Valley. Our item cards were Bodybuilding Dumbbells and Nest Ball. Energy cards, two Psychic Energies and a Steel Energy. And just the general Pokemon that we pulled today from the four packs we opened up. Goodbye, Pangoro, Ferrisseed, Furfro, Corsola, uh, Chikorita, C Dot, Cubone, Metapod, Electros, Sorks, Esper, Pansage, Panpaw, Porygon, Rhydon, Cacturn, Dublade, Chimchow, Roly Coley, Blitplug, Frillish, Steeny, Poliwell, Butterfree. Picky Peck, Kavana, Togodomaru, Chinchao, Makuhita. The only coin that we got was this Volcanion. Because it came with this tin. Three green code cards. One green and right code card. Where do I buy them? Uh, you can buy Pokemon packs from eBay. Uh, WH Smiths, Tesco's, Asda, you can buy them from the Entertainer, you can buy them from Game. If you let me know what country you're in, I can probably recommend places that you could buy them in your country. As if you're in the UK, I know a lot of places you can buy Pokemon packs for, but I don't want to recommend something if it's not available to you. So let me know what country you're in and I can give you a better description of where you can buy Pokemon packs from. We also got a green and white code card, which means, you know, we, we had one decent pack for today. I live in Indonesia. Um, try magicmadhouse.com or Amazon. Amazon is a great place to buy Pokemon packs. Fairthrow was one of our pulls. 
Neubat was one of our pulls. Beware was one of our pulls. Bliplug was one of our pulls. And our best full pull for today was Cherum. Great card. So yeah, guys, thank you all for watching. I've been GMG News. You guys have been my lovely audience. I'll be back very, very soon playing um, either Pokemon Yellow or Pokemon Sun. Have a great day. Don't forget to subscribe. Turn on post notifications. And I'm going to catch you all in another video very soon. Peace.